Okay, continuing with our project here. Let's go ahead, shape it some more. Looking pretty good. See the back here? See the shape of the... Okay. Now let's go to the hands here. Let me go ahead and just get these knife marks out of here. Okay, let's go to the hands here. And we're going to kind of round the hands off a little bit. And then we're going to kind of come and take off sort of like this. Now watch this. I'm going to take and we're going to cut here, and we're going to cut here. There we go. I'm going to sort of bring back in this area on both sides at kind of an angle. There. See that? And then we're going to kind of... Let's go ahead. There we go. Like that. Bring that cut in there. Now let's kind of take and just lightly put a little cut in here. See that in there? Just to signify the bottom of the robe. Going in there like that. Just like that. See that? And then we will draw a little just a little line in between there. And we'll just sort of separate that. There we go. To signify, we just kind of whoa. Got me a little piece there that's, wow, I don't know what happened here. There we go. Put a little bit more pressure on that. I don't know what happened there. But uh, there, now you see that? See how that's done? Okay, let me just kind of, kind of come up there and just swing that underneath there. See how I'm kind of scooping? See that? like that okay now let me go ahead and just now what we can do we can draw a little Just a little, dig that out just a little bit in there. That's just like that, see? Whoop. 
I had a weak spot in there, folks. That knife went on through there. <laughs> There's there, in this area right in here. There must be some. I noticed how hard that wood was it for a minute. And then sometimes when you have those areas that have the wood, you can have some weak spots also in those areas. So you have to be real careful what's going on. That knife really dug in right in there. So you, you find that... Uh, a lot of cases you have where there's a maybe a break or a weak spot or something in there as we go but no harm done that's why I take small cuts folks weak you know because I don't I don't bear down and that's why you want your knife sharp okay all right now here comes the part it's not going to be difficult. We just have to do it. Okay. We're going to come in here. And I want my... I'm going to come out kind of like this. Where my robe... And same thing over here. We're going to leave a little bit, a little bit in here. And I'm going to cut down like that, and I'm just going to kind of come up like that. Okay. Same thing here. That's kind of like where the... See where I'm judging it on? Okay. All right. Now... Let's go ahead and make our little face in here. I just took it and I rounded it off like this, okay? Okay. Now we take the face. Do this and we come from the outside of the face and we take that wood off in here are we following me are you following me like this now be careful In this area, you want to be careful. What I mean is, don't take, don't try to take big cuts. Just take small, small cuts. Now, the face is going to be something similar where it's just going to kind of come down like this. See? It's like kind of, a, kind of an egg, as we might say. So we want to come in here and we want to remove some wood in here. See what I'm saying? Just like this. And remove some wood from the facial features in here. Just like that. Now, 
I can probably get my V tool and uh, See the idea here? Kind of take, and we're going to remove the wood. Now, I may take my V tool and help me with this a little bit. Be careful. <sighs> okay, let me show you. See that? Well, we're beginning to. The face is not going to be real, real detailed. It will be... But you're just taking your knife and very, very slowly with the tip, you remove <clears throat> areas of your... just like that. Okay? This is what you will end up with, sort of like, uh, as you begin to remove the wood. <laughs> 